Hey everyone, welcome back to RimWorld Alpha 12 Vanilla playthrough with me, Reinstein. I hope you're all doing good. Uh, we've got a bit of excitement happening now. We've got a raid happening from a group of tribes people from Senra on, of Prairie Dog. And uh, you'll notice that a hunter is lacking a weapon. That's Mr. Pin. Uh, the reason for that is because we had some rampaging, um, what do you call them, mufflos in between recording sessions. Just a little bit extra I played, nothing to worry about. Um, so your weapon is hidden over there. So what I need to do is plan for this raid now. I'm gonna grab everybody, get everybody safe inside there. And the people with guns, I'm gonna hide behind our newly built um, security wall there. So who else has got a gun? Lizzie's got a gun. Mickey D, I know you've got a little sort of M16 gun. And Reinstein, slight injury from fighting the Muffalo. Not, or deer actually, uh, not too much to worry about. So I'm gonna put him out here too. And let's get underway. Now they're approaching from up here. They could cause us some damage, but uh, I'm hoping we're gonna be fine. We've got, some, we've got a, a, a big muffalo there who could help us if, uh, if he so chooses. So here come the four gunsmiths. We've got loads of turrets who can attack them. Now I've moved this wall because I think it's better. These turrets will hopefully not shoot us now. Um, and hopefully if anyone gets anywhere near... Oh god, they can get, actually get in through there. Damn it. Did not see that. Uh, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. How am I going to deal with this then? Let's just see how this plays out, I think. Um, okay, well, these guys are safe here. There they go. Look, they're just waiting inside there. So what we can do now is send people off to start meleeing them, I think. We'll get Odie and Chloe on this guy. In too late, you're going to go on Tasker. Not not with Dummer. Dummer's absolutely useless. Mr. Pin, you haven't even got a weapon, so we won't worry about that. Now, mo thankfully, most of them are coming through here. So let's just zoom out and see how this plays out. Odie is... Oh, in too late. Yeah, you're chasing Tasker. Okay. So let's see how these guys are going. Hopefully these ones up here shouldn't have any problem. Okay, I'm just going to pause for a second, see how this is going. Good, Oz has taken out that guy. You can go and help fight that Tasker guy. Now let's see how the rest of this goes. You can see they're starting to melee attack my turrets, but we're getting a load of gunfire underway. They're going to blow one up at least. That's not too much of a problem. There are a big number of these people. We've got two who can take us prisoners so far. Yeah, they're trying to flee. I, I wouldn't flee that way, guys. You're going to... You're going to get shot that way. There we go. I think that is the last of them. We've pretty much dealt with that. Awesome work, everyone. Now to check on the injuries. So, Oz, what is the matter with you? You've got a cracked rib, a bruised right leg, and a bruised torso. Okay, so I need to get you into the into the medical or the hospital bed, actually. End too late. You've only got bruising as well. That's pretty damn good. I'm getting better, guys. Do need to patch up this wall though before uh, before the next attack. All right, you guys are free to do whatever you want. You guys are also free. I don't think any of you have got any injuries. Good. So now let's start rounding up the prisoners. So we've got this guy, Bero. Actually, let's check on his injuries too. Shredded torso, shredded stomach, crack in the sternum, and a shredded neck. Wow, he's been battered. And there was another one I thought that we could capture. Perhaps I'm wrong. Looks like there's only one who's... Oh no, there's one there. So let's grab that one. Lizzie, you grab him. Actually, check on the injuries again first. Whoa, severely injured as well. Bleeding rate, 100%. Okay, well, let's capture him anyway. Oh, no prisoner earmarked bed. Ah, okay. So I'm going to set this to a prisoner bed. And then hopefully we'll be able to capture this ergo guy. Or lady. Is it guy, lady? I don't know, whatever. All right, so get rid of these weapons, get them collected up. And then the next thing I need to focus on is getting actually another turret put in here. So let's go to security, put that in there. That's obviously lacking power now, so we'll get that built as well. Um, and let's see who's available to do... Oh, Chloe, you need to be unmarked. Let's see who's available to do some work. We need building and uh, repairing done. So let's have a look. So at the moment, we've got Mr. Pin. 
and Mickey L D, Chloe and Elfwin working on that. That's good actually. Alright, here I think I need a door. So let's get a door put in. Uh, structure. Oh. Uh, what should we make it out of? Wood? Let's make it out of wood. That doesn't really matter too much at the moment. Okay, and Elfwin, you are busy building the geothermal generator, which we started to build over here. That's the closest vent to me that I can see. Unless I'm going blind, which I probably am. I do wear glasses, so. What's Mickey D up to? Are you taming a wild boar? You know what? Cancel that. We do not want you doing that. So I'm going to grab hold of you and get you to focus on building this wall. Oh, I need materials. Uh huh. Well, I guess for now, what blocks have we got available? None. Hmm. Well, for now, then, we're going to have to build it out of wood. We can always come back to it later. Let's grab Mickey D again. Come to me, Mickey. There we go. Prioritize working on the wooden wall. And uh, if you remember, we actually still have our little Mega Scarab uh, beetle friends. We've got our little Muffalo there. That's supposedly a little farm, but I don't really like that, so I might get rid of that. Actually, then we could, then we could use them blocks, couldn't we? Sandstone blocks, let's remember that. And pause that. Let's cancel this bit. And then we'll use the sandstone blocks to build that wall. Where's the sandstone? Oh, it's not there yet. All right, well, we'll wait for someone to get rid of that. I've also got a farm area here, which I can get rid of. Um, just wait for the walls to be deconstructed. I'll get rid of that at some point. Oh, there's loads of weapons here that we need to get rid of, too. So let's get them hauled out of the way. Loads of bodies that need to be cremated. So cremate corpse. Let's just put that up to, like, 20. And... Ah, Oz and Odie. Ah, here we go. So Barrow's being treated. Oz, poor result. Ah, Lizzie, are you not a very good doctor? Let's have a look. Medicine, nine. You're pretty good. So let's check on Odie's health. We're getting some bandaging. Ah, they're only using the poor quality bandages. We must have run out of the high quality ones. Ah, well, better than nothing. Some treatment is better than nothing. And thankfully, they're not cuts, so bruises should heal up nicely. Um, these new prisoners, I need to set to chat and recruit. And better chat and recruit as well. How's this Doug guy doing? Okay, cool. So, is anyone working on that? Chloe is working on that. So now we've got our some sandstone block, so we should have that here. We can put that wall in place. Beautiful. So now we've dealt with that, we can fast forward a little bit. And an exotic goods trader has showed up. So, Chloe, what's your health like? Oh, you've got a bruising on your leg. Oh, no. So the exotic goods trader's not here. Ah, Mr. Pin, you now need your weapon back. Now we've got a moment without being attacked. Where are you, Mr. Pin? There you are. You're visiting a grave. Lovely jubbly. So where's that weapon? There it is. Get your sniper rifle back, and all will be well with the world. Now, what I wanted to do as well was deconstruct... Um, no, not that one. Deconstruct these lamps and put some nice colourful lamps in. So I'm just going to get rid of this power line. And leave that one there. Uh, let's go to furniture. I want to kind of make their little playroom a little bit more fun and entertaining. There we go. Beautiful. Alright, now what I'm also building here is a tool cabinet. Now if you can see, you probably already know this, but I didn't know. You can see these three lines coming off it, connecting to these uh, workbenches. Now that, the toolbox actually speeds up the, the production of them. So you can see that gives us a plus 6% um, increase in speed, which is kind of cool. Should enable us to do our work a lot quicker. Ah, oh, good. Odie's getting some food in. Splendid, splendid. How's our geothermal generator doing? We need loads more steel over there. Reinstein. Ah, you're building a small sculpture. Okay, we have made a couple of sculptures now. So we've got one in our playroom and one in our main hall here. Or our main cooking area. Ah, cool. They put a deer in there. Nice. We're going to be able to make some meat soon. Some meat meals. Bero has developed an infection. Too bad. I can't really fix it if it's on your torso. <laughs> Mr. Pin. What are you up to, Mr. Pin? Visitors from Kai Basculo are leaving. Good, good. We don't want anybody watching what we're up to. Get out of the way. Now, every so often I'm experiencing lag in this game, guys. Anyone have any any idea why? It's kind of affecting my recording a little bit. 
Ooh, a pirate merchant has called. There's a stop by. Let's call him. See what we can trade. So we can sell our prisoners if we want. I don't think I really want to. I'm going to sell those though. Pirate merchant's got the medicine. Way too expensive. That charge rifle would be lovely, but it's $2,400. No chance. Armored vest would be good too. Can't really afford anything, so let's just leave it at that. Chloe and Mr. Pin are finalizing our base here, or finalizing the uh, the wall here, so we, we'll be safe for a while. Now, I did notice something cool in the research area, or the, the production area. Research, where is it? Dun, 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 dun. Not in research, it's in miscellaneous, which is the multi-analyzer. Now, the multi-analyzer looks really cool because it speeds up research, and I could do with one of those, but you need gold, and I don't seem to have any gold on my map whatsoever. So unless I bought some, I can't really buy that. Plus our research is going pretty well anyway. So you can see we're running out of electricity here. Why is that? These batteries are not full. Maybe there's a break in the power line. Let's have a look. So that goes from there all the way across there to the batteries. Now it should be fine then. Huh. Okay, so as the sun comes out, hopefully these batteries will start recharging soon then. Now if I wanted to, I could build even more of these solar panels and could expand my base over here. But I'm not going to yet. I'm just going to let my guys relax after their, after their fight or their raid and uh, hopefully get my base back up in ship shape. Back up and ship shape. What's Chloe up to? Hauling sandstone blocks to the wall. Oh yeah, I'm building a wall around here. Because we've got a slight gap in our base here. And also, once we've built a wall, it'll allow me to get this steel, which is slightly running out at the moment. Um, we don't really have too much, if any, in storage. So, let's have a look. End too late to trying to recruit people. Oz is still gardening like a boss. What's Lizzie up to? Are you cleaning? Let's have a look. Cleaning dirt. Aha, uh -huh, okay. Well, that's cool. I don't mind you doing that. We could find some better job for you, though. So, let's go to work. And Lizzie, you're on smithing, so why are you cleaning? Smithing, so that's a wooden stonecutter's table. Hopefully she'll start making some stone blocks. I think smithing is what the, uh, is how you do that. Let's have a look. Smiths create weapons. Ah, we need to put her on crafting as well then. There we go. Because we're not building any weapons right now. So that being the case, let's go back here and get rid of smithing. There we go. There's a few little bits of repairs that need doing. Loads of bodies that need hauling away. Uh, who can we get hauling? Let's go to work. Elf win. Mining, constructing. This dumber guy. I'm going to get him hauling as well. He takes forever to move anywhere, but at least he'll be doing something, right? Poor mood. Dumber. <laughs> there he is. He's hungry. He's, hung He's hungry because he can't actually get to the food. Oh no, one of our mega scarabs died. No. Where's Mickey D off to? Training a buck. Uh -huh. Alright, well I think that's more of an early game thing. Although, he's already trained. So yeah, I'll let Mickey D do that. I was going to say it's more of an early game thing, training animals. And they should all focus on the base. But I don't think I need to worry at the minute. Um, what I'm going to do is deconstruct this wall here. Mine all of this remaining blocks here. And too late failed to recruit Bero. Bero, Bero. Come on, Reinstein, finish up with your project. How do we get these hydroponics growing? I suppose, Oz, you'll start doing that whenever you're ready. There we go. As I speak of it, he goes and does it. Beautiful. Got loads of meals in production. Uh, all these dead bodies everywhere. Chloe, will you haul one of the dead bodies? Yeah. Haul this guy. I'll just start doing doing it manually. Oh god, you've dumped him there. <laughs> Never mind. I suppose someone will eventually take them to that area. I could just focus on the work bit. Let's have a look. Chloe, yeah, let's set you to hauling, plant cutting, and constructing. Yeah, that's fine. Mr. Pin, always busy as usual at night time. Good stuff, my man. And all these little weapons that the uh, raiders have left behind, I'm going to get them sold. Eventually. Once we get a trader come along. That's it, it's becoming morning. Beautiful, beautiful. Now, what do you think of the playthrough so far, guys? I've had some positive comments. Mickey D thinks I'm doing rather well. Thank you, sir. I, I aim to please. 
Um, I actually think this is my best playthrough ever. I'm, I'm learning to deal with um, the problems a lot more than I normally do. Or raids, should I say. Um, okay, let's keep an eye on everyone. Spinny's cooking food. Lizzie is now making blocks. Good job, Lizzie. I want more blocks. Reinstein, a long way to go on your small sculpture. <clears throat> Reinstein's really good, actually, at art. Yeah, look, 12. He's not very good at anything else, but he's good at art and research, so that's all right. Yeah, get this wall finished, otherwise we're going to end up with a hole in our base, guys. Elfwyn, you're just chilling out, mate. Look at that. After the after the problems you had in the uh, zombie apocalypse playthrough, you're enjoying a relatively relaxed time now, which is good. Poor mood for Dummer. I really can't do anything for you, mate. If you carry on. I shouldn't have recruited you, really, but... Oh, we need another light in here. It's getting dark. And this light hasn't been built yet, either. Hmm. Uh, let's go to... Where? Furniture. In the, in the dining room, what colour lamp should we have? Should we make it nice and red? Yeah, we'll have that there. And that there. We'll probably get rid of that one. Einstein just collapsed there. Oh, I need to set this back to a normal bed. Oh no, power outage again. See, the good thing about me having my separate power lines... Oh, why are these disconnected? Is that these turrets uh, still get power, which is good. Let's check out why these are disconnected. Oh, they're still running on that main line. Okay, that's... Oh no, not, not the wooden wall. Power conduit, that's what we want to get rid of. And then I'll build this line back down there. And then them turrets will be powered. Sweet. Problem solved. Elfin having a sleep over there. Still think we need another bedroom, which is why I'm trying to get them to mine this area. Elfin. Come on, mate. Wakey, wakey. Mine this sandstone out of the way. No time for sleeping on the job, son. Lizzie's still making blocks. Good, good. And they're putting them down there. You always need the blocks to make your wall, your wall stronger. Ah, oh, Odie, you're enjoying yourself playing the little horseshoe game. Oh, there's no light on the on the lamp. Darn it! Let's go and get some power to the lamp. Mm -mm. I'm gonna try and start what I um, thought of in the last episode, which is to run power cables primarily through um, walls, just to make your base look a bit tidier. Look at that red light. That's beautiful. That is absolutely gorgeous. That's it, Lizzie. You keep producing blocks. Soon enough, we won't need any more, but for now, I think we do. Let's get rid of that pirate merchant. All these bodies are still around. Do you know what, Lizzie? If you could stop making those blocks for a while and do some falling, get some of these dead bodies out of the way because they make everyone sad, which I don't want. I want morale to be low. Outdoors raining. Alright, cool. We can do some lights outside as well, actually. It's pretty dark for them. They can't really see what's going on. Let's go and put some lovely lights out here. I assume they still work outside, right? Never used them before. Put one there and one there. Ooh, they can't really see what's going on here either. So let's get another lamp. Let's get a regular lamp put there. What I think I might do is expand this wall. So let's go and grab deconstruct. Yeah, if I expand this wall, then I can build more solar panels. So that's one thing. Um, and these are made of sandstone, so we'll get more sandstone blocks. Put them right the way over here, like so. Oh. Yeah, like that, I think. Cancel that one, cancel that one. That one. Ooh, there's a pistol there. That's shoddy. Yeah, we don't want that shoddy pistol. Yeah, look at our little playroom now. It's all blue. That looks kind of cool. Does it does it improve the beauty of things? Toggle room display. Dull. Somewhat rich. Rather spacious. Neutral. A little bit dirty. Nah, never mind. Don't worry about that. That's fine. Yeah, go Elfwyn. Now what I'm going to do is get... Uh, expand the no roof area here. 
<clears throat> excuse me, then I can build more solar panels. Just to let our electricity catch up a bit because we're running out of electricity. There we go, that's fine. So, well, I think this wall doesn't need to be quite so big. Uh, let's decrease it a little bit. Because then, hopefully, I give our turrets more shooting range. I'm going to get rid of that bit of wall there. And that bit of wall. Then I can improve that turret's effectiveness. So let's build that there. And that one there, like so. Lovely. Mm -mm -mm. Rheinstein still building that small sculpture, but nearly finished. And too late. Ah, Lizzie's burning everything. Good. Yeah, getting rid of some of these bodies. Fantastic. Mr. Pin, what are you up to? Ah, oh, you're deconstructing the wall, and so is Chloe. And there's a dead muffalo here. It's rotting. Let's just haul that out of the way. Where's she going to haul it to? To there. Hopefully they won't cut that up. That'd be disgusting. I imagine that's set in the, uh, in the butcher tables, in the bill there. We're still running out of electricity. What is going on, man? Need these batteries to recharge. Alright, so I think that about ends the episode, guys. We're doing rather well. Just waiting for some big attacks. We're well on our way to creating a, a, a great base and escaping, in fact, uh, I think. Eventually, we'll need to start building our spaceship. Thank you ever so much for watching. Please send me your comments, tips, tricks, anything you want to say to me. Just send it in the comments. Thank you ever so much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>